Oh, welcome back to the playthrough we've all been waiting for. Here we go. Well, let me just get some face to face. Welcome back. Night Cal here. Nothing crazy, nothing new. I had to take a little break, gotta get some lunch. Nothing new. That looks good. Again, this is all just test stream stuff. <clears throat> First day streaming. I already have a shitload of viewers. Tons of people respect the Night Cal. Here to save everyone, protect everyone from the figurehead. Which, if you stick around long enough, hopefully I can document my fight with the figurehead, my arch nemesis, and whatever danger he brings my way. Anyways, back to what we all came here for. What everyone's been waiting for, all zero of you. Doesn't hurt my ego at all. Not one bit. That's what I think about that. Let us get back to the magic of Hogwarts Legacy. All right. Get this back up and running. Turn the beautiful music back up, please. Thank you. All right. Oh. Much better. All right, let's take a look around, huh? Just got to my common rooms here. Naturally, we picked Ravenclaw. <laughs> this should be interesting. Must be different starting Hogwarts in your fifth year. What are you talking trash, bro? Watch me do spells around ya. Oh. And she's a first year. Then you can look at it like that. Mm, that's and not right either. Say, you can hold your tongue. Then you build a this is a bowl of fresh fruit here. Appreciate it. I don't find potions there at all. And if it's This place is rad. Feels like oh my god, Athelia. Deep breath. Hello, a mint. Why hello? Hey, would you like to take a look? Sure. What the heck? You looking at the the Gryffindor women's section? What are you doing, Can't brother? Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to Ooh. have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. No. Oh, yes. Never. So much to be learned from the stars. Also... There's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. Yeah. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. Cool, dude. I hope astronomy's on my schedule. Sounds interesting. I have good news for you. You are most schedule. definitely taking astronomy. It is required for That's all like forcing. Figures. That's forcing the accent there. You will be enthralled there. with the tower. Plus, a I quality don't, don't telescope can show you things schedule. you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Absolutely not. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Mm. Be seeing you. Nothing like the fresh smell of uh in the morning. All right, making friends. I, I'm you know, look, I'm being too judgmental. To wait for the right moment. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. What are you looking at? One moment. Watch this. Ugh. What is this? Someone threw a dumb ball. Jari. <laughs> Jari. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. What are you waiting? Right. What? What did you hope would happen? Yeah, that's I what suppose I'm I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. 
You Nothing like smelling like poop. To some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. Uh, yeah. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Yeah. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. <laughs> nice meeting you. You too, Everett. All right. Lot going on here, making sure the stream looks okay. Wonder why that thought. Can't imagine something this big. Not bad. I might turn some stuff down. Just to really make sure that we're okay. This time. Let's see what that does. Listens the load a little bit. All right. What's going on with Samantha? Mm, that's not right either. I want him to be in the perfect place, a place he'll be happy with, but I can't seem to find it. Mm -hmm. Great golden gobstones! I want him to thrive here! Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. I'm not <laughs> I have sure. a bit of I'll a thing for, for plants, it. as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? It is. Is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wigan World potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. He did teach me a few things before term, but that's all I can tell you. True. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wigan Weld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't You're it? You're a fraud. Ordinarily, perhaps, but it runs in my family. Too bad. We've a full plot Let of these little fellows back home. Burn him. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. Well, it sounds like uh, the sorting hat kind of effed up with you, huh? Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. Perfect. And I don't think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. All right, I'm done. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your ditany. Thank you. And good luck to you, too, on your first day. All right. Hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. Where are we going? Downstairs. Good 
Good morning. Hey. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? Mm. I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. We'll OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. Mm. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Cool. Here you are. What is this? Jesus, close it! Good lord. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. Not even phased. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so what does it do? All that's expected of a fifth Motherfucker year. just did origami in front of your face. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Oh. Now it's gone. Sorry. Thank you, Professor. But what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me, and we shall put it to the test. All right. This way. Okay. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Do you want it? You gave it to me. Why don't oh. you cast Revelio on this bust? Right. Revelio. What details the field guide can provide? That's a nice bust. Take a look. Alright, challenges. Cool. Okay. So all the pages that I just lost. Okay, okay. Let's check it out. Okay. Thank you, Professor. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Got it. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Oh. I'm following your lead, bro. Got the wand on the ready, son. <laughs> ah, oh, oh, good oh, oh. timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Flu flames. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Let's take a look. Human areas. <laughs> the Grand Staircase. Blue Flame. Where Blue Flames is undiscovered. Make entrance including Astronomy Tower. Okay. Use it whenever. Fast travel. Show me all the hints. 
Gardens. And here we are. Whoa. Quite the time saver. Yep. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Do they? You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. How do I get to the bathroom? It's Always coming. something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Absolutely beautiful. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. Cool. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. I'm done, Thank yeah. You, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Thank you Happily, for reminding me the weight to create of the situation. Additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Smells like a Jenny. We did take a bit of a detour. Oh no, I shouldn't have said that. Ended up exploring oh, wait, no, some ruins stop. and oh, I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Oh, Speak hey. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Dang straight. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Too Perfectly late. good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Okay. Might I rely on you, Professor? Bye! To explain no, you said but you go! Guide's map. Of course. Thank you. Oh, give me the map. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. To that. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Can I go to class now? It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Yep. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. See it. <sighs> Main quest. Uh-huh. Dragon Quest, yeah, 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 oh. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. 
Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Got it. Time to go to class. I gotta run with the battery on. Get out of the way. Shows me how to get there. Goosh. Quick, I got to take a shit along the way. Please stop him, you're fighting profession. Ah, uh, what you do. Nice. Professor Hecket. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. Mm. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, yeah. you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we mm. will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing right, I've shut learned up. as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Mm. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Steady your wand. Goosh, 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 goosh. Easy. Levioso. Boom. Now, let's try something a little larger. Basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. Yeah. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent, as Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Oh no. Levioso. Good. Now, the basic. Well done. Alright, I'm a pretty wizard. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Take on Duelist, all Duelist, you. take your marks. Time oh. for a proper Hogwarts. You're going down, Sebastian. Now, I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Okay. Because yeah, boy. 
This should be Levy easy. Levy Boom! Goose, 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 goose. Nothing goose. lucky about it. You're done. You're done. You're, You're done. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Oh! What are you doing up there? Potato. Stupid potato. Oh, and now, see, and this is just when it's the downfall. You're done, Sebastian. Join life, you too. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good a as beginner? you get. A beginner? Dude, I'm <laughs> the same age. I put you on the Not spot. Not bad for a beginner. And you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. Yeah. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So. I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. I'll practice on his ass. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Nice work. Uh-huh. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. What do you need, though? I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh. Fair I know it was going to be that. You owe me an honest Braggadocious duel when you okay. You know. You might be like a perfect it. fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Yeah. Count me in. That's Excellent. what we got. That's what we got to do. You knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. You done yet? Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. <coughs> Thanks. If you're interested. Till next time. Side quest unlocked. Oh, this is just... You've drawled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. I'm walking like you. I'm so old. Where's the, uh... What you got going on up here in this office, lady? Hmm. Um Where's this treasure chest? How can I zoom? Aight. Wait, what is this? Off on another adventure, are we? Maybe. Whee! Run, I gotta go to the bedroom! <laughs> just some student just hauling ass. I don't want to be that kid that runs to class, but... I guess I'll have to take that one on the chin. Look, look, look. Where's Hedwig? Professor oh, Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Seem easy. Some of us don't necessarily jerks. want him to get back to the library. 
Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Heck yeah. Thanks. Thank you. Hello. I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Yep. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? Nope. <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Yeah, Welcome bro. to year five of charm. This now, is the This will professor. be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. <clears throat> My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. This guy's awesome. Oh, Akio. Can't catch me. Akio. That is not bad. Mm -hmm. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. <clears throat> well, as you all seem okay. to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? Sure. So why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Okay. Eh? All right. <laughs> Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones. Akio. But instead of throwing the marbles, excellent control there. Yeah, it's okay. Very good. I'm on to you. That's it. Oh, beat that. Read it and whoop. Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. You want me to go? Yes, sir.
Well, that's not fair. Ah, oh, I got cold feet. No, I don't. I don't know. Excellent. Redo. There we go. I'm gonna knock yours off the freaking bowl. this a bit more interesting, shall we? No, dude, we're done. I won. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Let us see this. No, nah, dude, that was actually against the rules. Run it back. I look concerned as Krabola. And oh, oh, no, 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 yeah. no, 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 Wait a Watch this. No. No. You thought? Oh, come on. No shot. Okay, I was about to say. Done. Bro, I could just do a tinner. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Ah, oh, shit. No, there you go. That's how it's done, laddie. Very good, both of you. Well done. Thank you. So I'm the winner. There's clearly only one winner in that one. Me. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Yeah, thanks. It took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. It already is easy. <laughs> That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Let's team up. What a question. How big is you a god doing? Nah, bro. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. That's cool. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic.
It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu. Wagadu. But I'm glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Okay. Until next time. Of course, you can A word use if you words. would. If you're you so wanted to white. speak with me, Professor. We want. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Sounds good, bud. Hey, do you know where the bathroom is? What's up, Harry Potter? Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. Day coming along. Pretty good. Still can't find the bathroom. And I'm that kid that runs to classes, so it's going okay. Yo. Keanu Reeves? Robert Downey Jr.? Miss one. Whoa, whoa. Bye bye. Oh yeah. What's up? Yeah, this is sick. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, this is rad. I gotta use your shader. Excuse me. Excuse me. Tag along. Squat up. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same what thing. What about it? Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your Where's first Ron? classes went well? They did, Professor. Where's I Jenny? I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told Let me. Let it go. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumo? Professor Ronan Yay. did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily. 
to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spellcraft. Wand, thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander. Yeah, baby. Wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Too dead. I'm ready I to go. To get to Hogsmeade. Let's go. Well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. How about Sebastian? I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. The sooner you can enjoy your pickled knee crump kneecap. Your pickled pig's kneecap with a nice cup of elvish lamb blood. Cool. Uh... Get my way! Run! Professor Hackett is intimidating, but then she has a serious subject. Who are you? Oh, yeah, that guy. Alright, I gotta use the friggin' bathroom, dudes. We all know what we're talking about here. I gotta go to the bathroom. Don't worry, I'll be back.
All right, people, we are back. Let's get to the first little face face time. We are back. I know everyone is eager to look and continue the journey. I don't even know what my guy's name is. It's so hard to pronounce. It's very Hogwartian. Thank you for tuning in. We made it to Friday. It's a good Friday. Last of Us is tonight. Super Bowl weekend. We're just chilling. We are just chilling. So without further ado, let's get back into it. Alright, let's see what we got going on here. Some gear. We got ooh. Of course. Very cool. A hat? Nah. Ooh. There you are. Oh, oh, you have a oh, new spell to teach oh, me, oh. Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm, Reparo. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Yep. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More yep. frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. Mm. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. Let's go. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Oh, I'll start right away, Professor. Kind of want to get a wand, but okay. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Where are you at? Ah, uh, yes. Lumos. Oh, no. Levioso. <laughs> no! Revelio. What are you doing? Where's Bayjet? Do I gotta go over there? Huh. Oh no. Collect the flying page near the broken statue. Ah, yeah, tricky bagger. Accio. Boom. Oi. Let me learn it. Oh. Collection. Yo. Oh, no, 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 no. They are meant to give you first-hand experience 
as you proceed to master new bits of magic. Right. Good luck, and I shall see you soon. Run to class. A flying page must be around here somewhere. It was right here. Give me a Brilliant. Professor, I found it. I trust the preliminary. I completed the assignments, Professor. Shut up, I, I, I did it. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Okay. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Boom. Bada bing. Bada boom. Nailed it. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove yes. by the water. Repairer. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lacked it. Looks like it. How depressing. I just leveled up. Did you level up? Revelio. I'm coming for you. Sick. Well. Let me in, I gotta go to the bathroom! Another time then. Nope. Get that one, boy. This is insane. I should like to Oh, what a... <laughs> You know, I am impressed. I've seen this game kind of with the trailers and the start of everything, I was like, yeah, maybe, we'll see. I think that Marvel game just hyped me up a little bit too much. Yo, it's the homie, what's up? Hello. Let's go to Hello, looking for me? Yeah. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. Of course. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Good. Sebastian wouldn't have done that. Welcome to Hogwarts. This is Hogwarts. Holy shit. I can't believe it. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Same dude, Sebastian. No, yes. I had much. planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a butterbee in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. I want an owl. Oh, I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in. Let's go for a run. Come on, let's go. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Uh huh. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Yo, Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. Insane. She's talking but that's one perfect. Of the few times of year, I'm talking I would perfect, and we're sweating doors. our asses off running. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, 
I do not mind the cold like, so much. <laughs> it is hot because I'm getting used to. Uh, I did not grow up around. Can we get some water real quick? Oh, wait, over here. Whoa. I often spot lace wing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. So... <laughs> you know, I think, I think I should use this one. Look, from a forbidden forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something awesome. started them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. It's Hagrid's fort. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Yo, look at this dope outfit. Absolutely. Oh, you take it, you got a place in Quidditch. That's the Forbidden Forest on the left. It's off limits to students, <laughs> as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. The toilet is closed. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Stand by, hold ah. on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry. We got even. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hold me over the crest. Pass that ruin. I would Yo. spend all of my time exploring if I could. What's this? I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area. Hey, since you're relatively new here. For a little extra she said curricular that? activity. Mm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Yeah, we should have gotten some broomsticks or something. More mushrooms, yes, please. Hey, I'll take them. How are you settling in? Pretty good. I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my family, but it is beautiful here Moon's too. Dead. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts yeah, has yeah. become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Yo, dude, what's up? Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss Van Eyne. Uh, turn and run. You got shot hands. You got shot hands. Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jimmy, guys, Dudley and Arian. Mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Are you okay? Poor Mr. Moon. A Debbie, guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Yo, Hogsmeade. There totally is. I am happy there to more. explore whenever you'd like. 
rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. Thanks, Natty. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. He's going nowhere quick. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter. See that guy? He's going nowhere And you can quick. get any sweet you run, can brother, imagine run. at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain run. to find everything Ashtar. you need in Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcrafts, some uh, seeds, and, and a wand. Just, I want to get the wand. wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Cool. Experience hugs me at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Go. Cool. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. London and Paris? Is that going to be a DLC? In London and Paris? Oh. Ollivander. Potion. J. Pippin. Potion. The boy went first, right? Go first, get the potion. All vanders and let's get some new threads. What's this? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Ah, oh, the ditany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Thank you. Quick. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Bro, I'm trying to get in and out. This just is not. Do have a look around. Plenty of nope. ingredients to pique your interest, Thank aren't you. we, Jeff? Trying to get some new clothes. And some new underwear. My underwear is a fifth year. Uh, let me get the map. Map. Potion. Whoa, dude. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. You got anything for bad gash? Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Nope. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in no, Hogsmeade, actually. No, Is it really? Well, I don't think you've Harry understood or heard sons. the talk, but I'm... And this is J. Pippin's Pushins. Imagine for all able to come here. You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl ah. about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. 
Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Yeah. A potion's really that versatile. Yeah, yeah. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. True. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Thank you. Trying to get some new clothes, too. So just hurry up. What can I do for you today? Uh, just, you know. I just want this. How much coin do I have? I have zero coin. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Some green gloves. Running. Get out of me way. Sick hat. Sick reds. And then why? Where's the toilet? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. The conjuring? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. You're ah, made, uh, but you will turn. soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course. And you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Yeah, yeah. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? If you're interested, nope. feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. I don't have any money, dude. You are now for the cool shit. I'll be right with. Ah, what's up, dude? It's you. Yeah. Um, just a moment, please. I gotta take a dump. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand? Yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time? Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you now? Good lord, how does oh, everyone what know? I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. Yeah. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, you are yawning no, so much. No, I no, drink in this entire thing. Um, I'm yawning. Ah, yes. Yes. Mm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Mm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. 
Well, go ahead, swish. Can I get a cooler run? Thank huh. you, it doesn't work. How odd. Hey, it don't work, I need a repun. Really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? Nope. <laughs> uh, um, I'll take the one behind your ear. We'll find you something, not to worry. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. Special edition. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Goodness. Ah, looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. Yeah, man, I mean, I thought you were good at wands. Uh, um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. I think you might be the one. Here. Take it. I... Oh, here we go. Oh, man, this is gonna be cool. <laughs> right, let's see what we can do with this. Curious wow. indeed. Mm. How intriguing. Why do you like that one so much? It's like so. Curious indeed. What is it? Do? How intriguing. Just a friggin' Curious indeed. Mm. Curious indeed. How intriguing. How is it curious? Leave me alone! How intriguing! I don't know what I want. What's the right decision, dude? Curious indeed. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Ah. 
Ah, Phoenix Feather. Exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. So we got. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Thank you. Now, how did that feel? Good. Pretty good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a Phoenix Feather Core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. True. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Peace! Well, that's everything. Better go and find Natty. Cool. Well, hold on. I'm running. Hold the phone, Natty. Oh, hey, dude. Yo. Is she time for a cuppa? May I? Yeah, I can't talk to you. That's kind of cool, does it follow you? That's very sweet. Hey, bud. Fifty. Fifty gold coins. Take another cup of tea. Thank you. It's too bad. Can't even get some new ah, clothes? I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. him at his own game. Naughty! 
I just Goodness. killed I just killed a something. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? Like I said. I suppose so. I've been dealing with trolls. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. Yeah, I'm good. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed. Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, mm. officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Oh, hello there. A, a moment, if you would. I will see what he wants. What is... Okay. You're gonna reward me with some threads. Repair one. That good as new. We need a clean ice cream stand. Make sure the ice cream stand is up and running. We can't lose that. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. It's like Lego Harry Potter. <laughs> Repair her. Repairer. Yeah, I'm that good. I'm that good. I'm that good. Getting some clothes. We were just talking about you. Thank you. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. Mm. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, mm -hmm. and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to mm -hmm. its rightful state. Mm -hmm. I was happy to help. Mm. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrags wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. I would like to get... Alright then.
Chris. That was a... Uh, the end. Is this in the No, no, it's different. Nice shit. Oh, Topat. Ah, oh, ew. Those are cool. It's okay. Thanks. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. I sell even more battle-worthy items, should you be inclined. You're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. We drink all your tea, son. Let's get a bay at the three broomsticks and maybe some pickled knee knuckle. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. Not gonna run. Oh, I saw a page. This guy. You said you could Dish get to the gay. child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Dishke. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Dang. <laughs> Let's go. Did they see us? Yep. I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Mm. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Okay. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Don't be Heard lazy. about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. You have internet? Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> oh. oh, time, lame. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Yeah. Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Okay. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. See ya. Can't drink butterbeer forever. And her outfit sucks. <sighs> C 
seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. Okay. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. Everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. We were nice and sloshed. the dogs out. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Don't worry.
and we are back. Just like that. We are back. Just like that, we are back. Alright, we'll continue our journey a bit further. customization over there. Adalbert Serpin. Magic. Not bad. All right. <coughs> Sorry. Keep it running. All right, let's get the crap out of here, dude. I am certainly glad Serona was there. Yeah. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. She'll be fine. Common room. Booyah. Travel. Quickly. Travel. Mind if I just go to bed? Can I go to bed real quick? Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found in the... At Green Gods. Oh, no! Will do. 
Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Is that what you've always said? Run to class. Oh, I'm dizzy. I. Gotta go into the teacher, teacher's room. Hey. Oh, there you are. Oh, what the heck? Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was Good in Lord. Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. Indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted mm. section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected Whoa. you would see something. Should we go? Broke a little I wind. appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm <coughs> eager to discover what we may find there as well, but... If our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit, before we continue. Okay. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your mm. defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Okay. I did want to get that page at Hogsmeade. Just real quick. Just a real quick, real quick little swoop in. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Nope. There you are. Accio! I've unlocked something.
incendio. A nice trim. There we go. Dude, let me get to the, uh... There it is. Where do I need to go? Fast travel. Hang in there, everyone. Got a lot of people watching. Source indeed, your field. Yo. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs. And, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. Mm -hmm. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. You know where to find me once you've finished. Rebellio. Seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. Might some kind soul help me? No. My guy right there. Glad you could make it. Lucan's just over there. Revelio. What's going on with this guy? Oh, hey, dude. Can I help you? Oi. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. Got great hair, it's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. A little bit, yeah. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does crossed ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. Me. And me. to liven things up, That's the me. winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, 
In crossed ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Sure. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Nice, we'll make nice you hat. regret signing up. Yeah. Repair her. Levios. Act like a winner. Cook, 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 cook combo. Dead. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second duel is ready when you are. And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Cool. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. I'll be back, don't worry. Hey, you tucked in your robe when you went to the bathroom. <laughs> what are you looking at, Seb? Back. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Yeah, yeah. I'm ready. Yeah. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? And your dreams. Apologies in advance. Repair it. Easy. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning, or at least surviving the next round. Yeah, yeah. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak.
Levioso. All right, well, I think I'm going to get off. Be back on in a little bit. Be back on in a couple hours. Don't worry. I think, uh... Maybe like... I don't know, 6.30 or 7. Kind of see where that takes us. Alright. Until then...